Chris Page wins the second race with the well-bred trotter, Baby K, by the great Yankee Glide. Nice mare here, out of well-bred mare, out of an Andover Hall mare. And uh, Chris Page gets the uh, winning call, almost a wire-to-wire -wire win for Chris with uh, a Baby K. Moving right along uh, to race number three, eight minutes to post time. This is a non-winner, so one, and as my uh, partner Barry said, this is really a nice race of young horses. And speaking of young horses, today was the day. Had to have that money down if you wanted to get into the Ohio Sires Stakes. Uh, the old whiz, he had a fork over some horses, uh, horse money today as uh, uh, we had to put some in the sire stakes and uh, you had Delaware payments for the uh, races at Delaware and the State Fair. It's going to be a great year of uh, racing in uh, Ohio at the fairs and today it, fe it feels like uh, spring and summer uh, upon us right now, temperature in around uh, 70 degrees right now and you got to have a lot of horses here uh, Ohio breads in this race here that you're going to see at the uh, fairs and in the sire stakes uh, right now uh, I like the three five to one I'll tell you uh, he's made this race three uh, his own lately Mark Evers and he has one of his uh, uh, homebreds in here Velocity Phil off a good qualifier strong 57 qualifier and uh, I'll tell you when he qualifies him you know uh, his horses are going to have more in the tank so I look for a, a big effort out of Philosophy Phil he's right now he's at the five to one uh, at the the favorite a Sterling and Foria uh, a three-year-old uh, Western Ideal is uh, at nine to five the five is at nine to five Barry likes number eight slide ruler and I remember uh, his, his father a uh, stud named Sue really a nice racehorse and has had limited success as a sire I think a stud named Sue was out in California for a while standing in a stud if my old, rem old memory comes back to me uh, this one will have Andy Shetler in the bike and this is off of a good qualifier number one uh, uh, Skyway Padre, uh, also uh, a nice green uh, uh, pacer, which uh, I think has a good chance to get on the ticket. Right now, the one is the 9-5 to five, uh, uh, choice with five minutes to post time. I still... Uh, oh, I like those. I told you the other day about uh, one of Ever's horses, and right now, uh, Velocity Phil, uh, 7 to 1. Nice price to start out. Number 7 uh, is 5 to 2, T.C. Beck. And uh, this is another Ohio bred youngster, a three year old. So, right now, uh, kind of watch these Ohio bred pacers and uh, these young horses uh, as they come out and develop, see who's going to improve and who's going to be uh, a major player as the uh, summer uh, rolls, or rolls around. But on this race, the Wizard is going to stay with his number three choice. Barry goes for number eight in a very good race of young horses. Pace, baby pace. Horses on the track, ready to post for the third race. The condition pace, purse of $5,000, no changes. Exact to try, super and rolling daily double wagering. Here's the field, number one is Skyway Pondre, owned by John Raynard with the Kylator. Two is Wise Latina, owned by Ted Gertz with Tyler Smith. Three is Velocity Phil, owned by Velocity Standard Brad's Mark Evers Drives. Four, Ant Babe, owned by Joe Criswell, Hunter Myers. Five is Sterling Euphoria, owned by Brent Hopper, s, s Racing Stable in Kenneth York, Randy Tharms. Six, Woman's World, is owned by Troy Brown, Jason Brewer. Seven is T.C. Beck, owned by Richard Wyerly with Josh Sutton. 
Eight slide ruler owned by Bill Webb and Denny Miller, Andy Shetler. Nine real evidence is owned by Mandy Jones, Jeff Nysonger in the bike. Completing the field from the second tier, number 10, Angela Nicole is owned by Lisa Snyder and Gene Humphrey. Sandy Beatty is in the sulky. It's field for the third, win play show, exact to trifecta, super factor, rolling daily, double wagering, post times in three minutes. Starter calls the Pacers field of 10 headed towards the gate. Final call for rolling daily double weight and trade. It's post time for the third starting gates in motion. Condition Pacers, third race for Miami Valley Raceway. Full field of 10 are at the post, and here they go. Here off and a pacing. Velocity Phil gets the first call, center of the track. Sterling Euphoria left to the inside, racing in third is Wise Latina. Up on the outside, fourth is Ant Babe at the rail, fifth is Skyway Padre. 
On the outside, racing in six, looking for a seat is TC back. And then it is Angela Nicole to the inside. Up on the outside slide, Ruler is on the move early. Ninth is Woman's World. That one's off the rail. And as they race towards and past the quarter, the trailer is real evidence. Quarters on the board, 28 and four. And it's Sterling Euphoria who shows the way. Velocity Phil is right there in the pocket spot. Racing in third at the rail is Wise Latina. And Babe sits in. First stop is Skyway Padre for Aider. Tracking that cover, TC back. Third over then is Slide Ruler. Inside, Angela Nicole is next. Outside, ninth, Woman's World. And the trailer is real evidence. Hit it around the turn. They drive for the half. And it's Sterling Euphoria, the leader. Randy Tharps tapping the brakes a bit with her as they pass the half. 59 seconds, 30 and one-fifth on the second split. Velocity Phil is in there second. Three wide, here comes TC back with a backside brush to the inside is Wise Latina. In between horses, that is Skyway Padre. At the rail, Ant Babe. Slide Ruler is still six with about six to make up as they head towards three quarters. Then it is Angela Nicole. Woman's World in the gapping trailer. Real evidence losing touch with the field as they pass three quarters in 127 and two, 28 and two. Backside, Sterling Euphoria with the lead. TC back. Is inching closer on the outside. Velocity Phil revved up and ready to go from the pocket spot. Tough to steer. Wise Latina races greenly and wide as they turn into the stretch. They're off to turn it on their way home at Sterling Euphoria. TC back on the outside. Velocity Phil giving chases now second. And Babe comes on to the center of the track, but it's Sterling Euphoria. Coast to coast to win it. Sterling Euphoria tied for second between and Babe and Velocity Phil. 156 and 2. Unofficially, first number five, Sterling Euphoria. Second, the four, Ant Babe. Third, the three, Velocity Phil. Fourth, the seven, TC Back. Five, four, three, seven. It is unofficial. Judges posted the inquiry sign. It is a general inquiry into the racing action of the final quarter. Judges' inquiry on the board will not affect the unofficial winner. Headed back and into the All-State Winner Circle unofficial winner of the third race, number five, Sterling Euphoria. is a three-year-old daughter of Western Ideal out of the real artist mayor, Chattanooga. Homer Brent Hopper of Lexington, Kentucky, s, s Racing Stable of Lebanon, Ohio. And Kenneth York of Cincinnati, Ben Davis trains. Randy Tharps is the winning driver. 40th win of the meet for Randy. First career win for Sterling Euphoria in 156-2. After a judge's review, no reason for any placings. The race is now official, and Sterling Euphoria pays $7 to win. 5-4 exact to $150.20. 50 cent trifecta, $267.80. Dime Super, $177.58. Rolling double, $40.20. Here's they finish the third race. Skyway Padre, eight. Wise Latina, five. Velocity Phil, three. And Babe, two. Sterling Euphoria, the winner. Woman's World, nine. TC back, four. Slide Ruler, seven. 
Real Evidence, 10, Angela Nicole, 6. Green checking, 853-219-4710. 6 on the bottom, first career win for Sterling Euphoria at 156-2. Fourth race is up next.